so this is the viscera of the diaphragm uh, with part of the pericardium uh, these are the part of the pericardium these are the part of the pericardium and part of the pleura here the lungs is situated so the covering of the lungs is also situated here these are the portion of the parietal pleura here the diaphragm the lower end of the lungs that is lower surface or inferior surface of the lungs is situated here so these are the parietal pleura diaphragm parietal pleura and part is the diaphragmatic pleura okay and here the lung is situated so this portion is known as the mediastinal pleura so we can say here this is the viscera of the diaphragm with part of the pericardium fibrous pericardium part of the diaphragmatic pleura and part of the mediastinal pleura here the part there are two part of the diaphragm this shiny tendinous portion is known as its tendinous part or central tendon and these are the muscular part so there are two part one is the tendinous part central tendinous part and peripheral muscular part there are three major opening present in the diaphragm in the central tendon in the central tendon this opening this opening in the central tendon this is vena caval opening okay and this is esophagus part of the esophagus so this opening this opening is the this opening is the esophageal opening and here is another opening which is missing in this viscera this is aortic opening okay and in the posterior aspect there are two portion these are known as the crust of the diaphragm this one is the right crust which is longer and more muscular and this one is the left crust this is smaller okay so and then surface this this one is the thoracic surface or superior surface and this portion is the abdominal surface or inferior surface how we we'll able to identify the surface by seeing the central tendon central tendon situated in the superior surface and this two portion these two portion are known as the dome of the diaphragm and the apex of this dome is known as the copula okay now come to the anatomical position so this is the viscera this is the viscera of the diaphragm with part of the pericardium and part of the mediastinal pleura and diaphragmatic pleura then portion of the pericardium is attached in the central tendon and which is lies above in the central position and slightly anteriorly okay then the pleura the pleura of the diaphragm lies posteriorly and the convexity of the dome of the diaphragm the right dome of the diaphragm lies slightly higher than the left dome the right dome is slightly higher than the left dome because of presence of liver thank you